Hi Taurus, it's Elle here to do uh, a quick reading for you. All right, so let's get into it. Thank you, God, for blessing Taurus with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so Taurus, you got the Page of Wands. You got the drama, 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 chameleon. Yep. You got the nasty white shirt. All right, so it looks like you might have come out of a situation maybe with a masculine energy where it was karmic. It was drama. It, you had a lesson to learn. You just kept showing up for the relationship, hoping that there would be change, but there was none. I'm getting like somebody could have had like um, bad hygiene, you know, like nasty white shirt, bad hygiene. Okay. Um, somebody is like... Um, a con artist or uh, they try to con you or they try to gaslight you or turn it all on you or they're um you know um manipulative this is somebody who acts like the drama is you but it's really them and a little bit of you you can't argue by yourself right but you know um maybe they they are the reason okay it's like they try to act as if they're not the drama because the chameleon is here. This person could be like under like. There could. It's something about this person that they're not being honest about. They're not being forthcoming. They're not just being truthful. It could even be indicative of like possession, like negative entity possessing them or possessing their mind when I got off camera when I was like meditating for you somebody like a massive headache you know massive headache um it, it was like stemming from doing the same thing over and over again or thinking about something over and over again or allowing this person to come back over and over again it's like at the bottom of the deck you have full moon so it's like you need to release on the full moon we release uh we relinquish all of those emotions all of those thoughts so there's some feminine energy maybe that needs to release here. You need to release this. It's You're just doing too much of the mental gymnastics trying to really make sense of this. And it just don't make sense. That's all it is. You've given this person maybe chance after chance. And it, every chance was drama, 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 drama. Until you realize that they are a drama chameleon. Like... They try to act or look like they're not the drama, but they are. They try to act like they're nice when they're not. They try to act like they're nice, but they're nasty. Or they can be nice, nasty with you. Or they just all together nasty. There's a difference between messy and nasty. Like your house could be messy. Like you got papers over here. Maybe you need to, um, you know, um, straighten up things. But nasty is you left food in the sink and the, you've got dishes in the corner you've got underwear in the you know uh the laundry basket that you hadn't washed in months i mean nasty is nasty right so somebody is nasty so it is um a old oh, character so this is something to come up about about their character so character is historical reference over a certain amount of time so historically what have you seen from this person over a certain amount of time? That's who they are. Stop thinking that you're going to get something different. This person could maybe possibly want to make up with you or they, they're saying that they've changed or they will change. They could also be trying to see how far they can get with you. Let's see what's going on here. You could be dealing with someone younger than you. I heard coddling or this person needs a lot of coddling or like nurturing. You got time for it, right? see yeah family changes um so maybe you you broke up with this person or they broke up with somebody or they left someone or they're getting kicked out or maybe they lived with someone or a family member they're coming back to you uh, maybe they have like a wife or ex yeah healing from the past okay so this could be you and them you're healing from this relationship they're healing from it too there's something where Something affected everybody. So now this person is resurfacing in your life. So it, it affected everyone around them. Maybe even you. It's could have been a marriage or a committed relationship. There was some drama that happened. And now they're coming back to you. Healing from the past. Okay. Um, 
as soon as you try to heal, here they come resurfacing, bringing up the drama. Maybe you're trying to heal from some drama from the past. It, it stems from them or them, other people, you know, all kinds of people or certain, you know, circumstances. Motivation. That's what I'm talking about. With your fi with finances, so you get a question. This motive. This person's motivation, maybe for resurfacing in your life, or someone is doing this in regards to you. They're questioning your motivation. Why are you showing back up? If this is about you, it could be the other way around. It's like, do you need finances? What is the motivation here? Because we're done. We're over. You need a place to live. Because we got family changes. Someone leaving, getting kicked out, moving. Having a baby, not enough space, family change. So it affects like a group, a cluster of people, right? Yes, yeah, sobriety. Maybe you come to some sober thinking about this person or they need to. Remember the vision I was getting off camera for you. This person holding their head like they have a massive headache or like they're, they're overthinking something. Or somebody is um, definitely needing to get clear about uh, what this relationship is and what it's not. What it is not is healthy. Okay. Um, we got the Queen of Swords wanting to show her face. So show her face. So you need to she cuts out. She's final. This is final. This is over. This is done. This person might need help, you know, getting sober, staying sober, but is that your do you need to take that on? You know, this person could be homeless at this time. Finances are a big issue for you or the other person. One more card for Taurus. Advice for Taurus. Yeah, let this rest. Let it go. Get some rest. It's like you've been you've been putting expending too much energy on this. Like you just keep going. And you're just going to get the same thing. And maybe this is why this person comes back to you. Because they know they can just get you talking. They can get you wrapped up in the drama. You know, they got somebody on their side. Or or at least they got you talking. Even if you're arguing and cursing with them. But it says, let it go. Let it rest. It's done. You Be done with it. There could be some young person in your life who's a lot of drama. Okay? Uh, it could be a feminine energy. Who is nasty? I don't know. Something about children could be asking the children to leave or sending the children off. Are you making some final decision about um, maybe your finances, getting your finances in order, questioning your motivation? You're just gonna be true to you and stop maybe doing for other people or and putting yourself last. Some people don't like this, you know, they be maybe talking about you, how you or like, yeah, what is your motivation behind this? But it looks like you just want to do for you and worry about you. So this is what I have for you, Taurus. If it resonates for you, go over to the website and book your reading there. Ask a question or two by texting it to the number below. You can also catch me live every Tuesday and Thursday. Thursday nights, I answer free questions and I do a collective reading. Next Thursday, not this Thursday, we'll have our Halloween party. I'll be dressed in my costume. You should come dressed in yours. Hit the Zoom link so I can see you. You can see me and I can answer your question for free. All right. Um, keep in mind that readings are on sale right now. $25 for 10 minutes with me. Go ahead and book. I'll link it below. This is what I have for you, Taurus. Many blessings to you.